Now, it's not uncommon to get a column of records. Well, that's not a proper data set. And in the old days, I would use VBA to convert it from a column into a table. But now we simply use wrap rows. The vector, Control Shift down arrow, Control Backspace, comma, there are nine elements that want to be across nine fields. So I put a nine, close parentheses, Control Enter. That is amazing. The other day I got stock data and it came like this. I need it in a proper table. Well, I'm first going to attack these field names equals two row unique highlight. And the first four are what we want. So unique will hit them just fine. Those are the field names equals wrap rows. Here's the vector. Now, if I want to connect the formula input to the information coming from the spreadsheet, I'm going to use the columns function and count how many fields there are. Four. That means we'll wrap four rows. And bam, uh-oh, we have text numbers. We can fix this. Any math operation, including plus zero, will convert the text numbers back to numbers, including the dates and the money amounts. And there's our proper data set. F2 wrap rows comes to the rescue. I can't believe I used to write VBA to do this. Now all I use is wrap rows.